Hello my friends, how are you? Welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, welcome. My name is Dana and today I am going to be doing a cash stuffing of, I believe it's $265. Um, my little kitty is next to me so if you hear like, I don't even know, it's purring. <laughs> <laughs> but she sounds like she's like congested and can't breathe yeah <laughs> but um yeah she's sitting next to me so you might be able to hear it um but yes how are you guys I hope that you guys are doing a really or having a really good day and that you're doing really good um so let's go ahead and start counting this so I did take off the nail polish on my hands which are like frozen it's like one degree outside um, but, so, so the nail polish remnants is blue and then my hands are just frozen because it's so cold and I, I'm cheap and I, I don't want to turn my heat up. So I'm just keeping at a certain temperature. I think it's at like 65 or something in my house. I'm so cold. <laughs> All right. So I have 20, 40, 60, 80, and 100. 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 200, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, and 55. So I was off a little bit, but it's okay. So 255 is how much I have. Um, Today I'm going to try to do this as fast as possible because I um this is kind of like a bonus check for me. Um, so I am not going to be doing a lot of stuff in my bill binder and I'm trying to beef up other, other cash stuffings or cash envelopes, I should say. So let's go ahead and put that money here over to the side. Bam, using a lot of my envelopes today. So the first thing that I am going to be doing is I'm just going to be putting $5 in each of my credit cards. Alright, so Hot Topic is going to be getting 5 TD Bank is going to be getting 5 Burlington will be getting $5. I'm not going to count these. There's just bills. Um, and then JCPenney is going to be getting $5 as well. So, yay. I'm going to try not to ramble in this one. And it might be hard, guys. It might be hard. <laughs> because we all know. So, I just did my cash stuffing yesterday for um, the first week. And because this is kind of like a bonus check for me. Like I said, I'm going to be putting it into other things, but there are things that I know that I'm, I'm lacking. I already got gas today, which was very appreciated because I was on zero. Um, right now I am going to be putting money into my food budget for the month. Um, I'm thinking about doing a bigger envelope. So we're going to be putting $60 in this. Um, but I'm thinking about doing a bigger envelope for my groceries. Just so that way um, I don't have to like really carry all this money with me. But also because if I go grocery shopping I'm either going to do it online so I have to put the money in there anyway. Or I'm going to be stopping at like Walmart on the way back from church. So... Right now I have 50, 70, 90, 110, 120, and 125. And then um, I believe right now, just because of my situation, this groceries budget is not going to be getting like a rollover um, where I take everything out. Like if I don't use this, excuse you, mm -hmm. <laughs> um, if I don't use this $10, I'm going to take it out at the end of the week, put it in my rollover, and then at the end of the month when I add up all my sinking funds, I'll decide where this one is going to go. But, let's see. This one I don't think is going to do that because I need food, guys. <laughs> Look at this. It's already crushed. I'm going to be getting paid in, I think, like, five days i usually get paid on 
Wednesday and today is Friday. So yeah, I'll figure that out before then. Um house, because I didn't put anything in there before, is going to be getting 20. What? I'm weird. Stop looking at me like that. <laughs> My cat is just staring at me like, what is wrong with you? <laughs> Alright, pets are not going to get anything because I just bought them food and I bought them everything else. Um, well, litter and litter boxes. And then the bus is going to be getting $5 just in case. I have to take the bus for some reason because oh, one minute I have a car, the next minute I don't have a car. Yeah, it's a mess. So... That is in there for right now. Joining out. Pause it. Not getting anything. Alright. My dream binder, which we don't really see that much. I'm going to be stuffing in here. So Silver Scream Con is something that... This is like my only activity for the whole entire year. That I know that I'm definitely going to. And that's in August. Um, Silver Scream Con, in case... You guys don't know it's gonna be the second annual so um there's a band called the ice nine kills the um lead singer is spencer charnas he's pretty awesome i've met him yelled at him you know all that great stuff um <laughs> so i let celebrities know they're not better than me because i yell at them no i i met him he was a great guy um but he is like obsessed with horror so um, it's kind of like a horror con type thing that he does. And I met like Doug Bradley. I met Jamie Kennedy. I've met um, Kane Hodder. Met a whole bunch of people there. So this is something that I know me and my family are going to be doing. So I'm gonna, whenever I have extra money, put it in here. So right now I have 20, 40, 50, and 55. So I believe it's like, I don't think it's $60 per ticket. I can't remember how much it is. Um, but we originally wanted to go to all three, three days, which is like 120 bucks. And then if you wanted to go to the concert that was attached to it, it was like 330 per person. It, it was a lot, but, um, the tick, the concert ticket is sold out. So it's something that I'm going to start saving for, for next year. So I could at least go to the concert and meet like, um, Ricky, let me see his last name, Amar Amarella. Something like that. He's pretty awesome and he live streams all the time. And so I feel like he's my friend, guys. Alright, so um car is going to be getting five dollars. This is for a new car in the future. Because I desperately need one. My mechanic wants to sell me a car. He has it listed right now for ten grand, but because of my situation, um, he's like, Yeah, I'll definitely give it to you for like sixty five because I go to them for everything. And so, like, he's been taking care of me for a while. I love this guy. Um, such a great guy. He reminds me of my grandpa. But he's like, I'll sell you this car for 65 If, you know, the other car. Like, if it doesn't sell for 10 grand and it just sits there by the time I get the money. Yeah. But, um, hopefully, I should be getting money soon. Which is gonna be about six grand. So, this right here is just going to be for, um, like, registration, stuff like that. But if not, then, yeah. All right, I have five. Nope, I have 20, 40, 50, 55, and 60. And, yeah, I love my car, but it needs too much work right now. It's already at, like, three grand that it needs. And it's just so hard, guys, because... Like, I grow attachments. <laughs> I'm attached to my car. I don't want it to leave me. But I know eventually it's going to have to. So for money down, I'm just going to put $5. This is money down toward on a house. Um, I want to buy a piece of land. And eventually build on the land. And I've been looking at tiny homes, stuff like that. And it's, a, um, I guess it's just going to be like me and my daughter because my son in a couple of years is going to be going off to um, a university he's thinking about in Boston. So, I don't know. I don't know. But I'm at least still not giving up on that dream right now. So, ugh, I hate when these are like twisted. Alright, there we go. 
All right, that one is done. Let's move on to this one. This one, I believe, is only getting for car maintenance. So this is my Halloween or my holidays and then, like, other important things. Once I do my emergency fund, which is $1,000, I'm going to start saving for vets. My cats go every year. Um, they have a couple months before they have to go back. And then my, like, over Christmas... My aunt's cat got, like, really sick. They think she has pink, pancreatic cancer. Um, and it was just, like, a huge shock because I was the one that brought her to the ER. So, like, for everything that was going on, it kind of went through me. And then I translated it to my aunt who was working. And so, while I was taking care of this poor kitty, they were like, oh, it's going to be um, $3,500 for her to be seen today at this emergency vet. And... It's heartbreaking. Like, these are your, your animals. I know, like, they're your family. But I'm like, should they be charging that much for stuff? Sorry. Car maintenance is going to be getting 20 I'm just going to throw this in there. But I'm like, $3,500. Then we had to take her to another vet. Which, it was like 30 something My aunt ended up spending like seven grand. Just to get her cat seen and, you know, x-rayed and all this other stuff. And it's overwhelming, guys. I hope that your pets stay healthy. I hope my pets stay healthy. My other one just came to visit me, too. Elias. Yeah, you can't see him because of the camera. <laughs> but he's staring at me because he knows I'm crazy. Alright, so for car maintenance, I have 20, 40, 60, 65, and 70. So this $70 is going toward car maintenance, probably on the newer car. Um, because my car is just blowing out smoke right now. And yeah, it's not improving at all. So we have this one. This one is my household binder, everyday binder, however you want to say it. Um, I know people do like high priority binders, low priority binders. For me, I just like to group them. It's just how my brain works, I guess. Like, like items with like items. Some are high priority, some aren't. But then I see things where, like, this one is kind of empty. Actually, this one has a gift card in it. But this one is kind of empty, so I'm like, I eventually know that I want to put something in there. As long as there's a dollar, I feel better. So, for a church, church is going to be getting $5. So, I have 5 and 10 right now. Jojo. My cat's going crazy. Sorry, guys. Um, okay, so for taxes, taxes is getting $10. Again, I won't know until three weeks from now if I get a pin or not what's going on with my taxes. So I have 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 56, and 57. So $57 it's gonna go to my taxes. I just need like I don't even know, like another 80 and then I'll be good. Um house or apartment. This is just basically things that I would need, like if I need tin foil or um I'm obsessed with like Mrs. Myers cleaning stuff. Like I I used to use like Dawn all the time. Um like, for my dishes, but my son, which is, like, so odd, but my son, um, he has really bad eczema and flare-ups, and he's actually allergic to Dawn. Like, have you ever heard of that? Where I thought, like, they use that on, like, baby animals, you know, in the ocean, but my poor kid is allergic to that, and so it breaks him out, and his hands dry up, but I've been using, um, Mrs. Myers, the lemon one, and he's doing really good with that, so... I don't know, <laughs> but, um, it's a little bit more expensive, but that's why I have the sinking fund, but it, it does last us a while, so I shouldn't have to buy anything for, you know, a while to come, but just in case I do have a couple bottles of Dawn underneath my sink, so I have 10 and 15 right now for house, this is also for, like, storage stuff, because I am trying to deal declutter my house and organize everything um i also do have a couple gift cards in here that i can use as well this one i have not been focusing on i've been trying to do um 
like I know that once we go to church when we get out we usually would go out to eat but now I'm trying to do like big Sunday dinners and have the kids help me so that has a $40 gift card in there but I haven't been using it this one is still unfortunately bare so is the luggage I threw away during my decluttering um basically every suitcase that I had because it either had a crack or I didn't have space for it or it was like broken in some way so yeah miscellaneous is going to be getting five dollars and this is basically if something comes up and I don't have a fund for it this is where it's going to come so I have 10 and 15 I have laundry Laundry is going to be getting $5 today, and last time I did laundry, it cost me $15, and all we did was all of our blankets and towels, so it's kind of expensive. P.O. Box. P.O. Box is going to get $5, and I have 5 and 10 in there. I do need $75 in the next, like, two months, but they'll let us know. And this is my rollover, um, whatever is left over in my wallet, which is this tiny one. So it's most likely going to be, if I don't use this gas, it's going to be like this $10 for gas. And then, I don't know about household. I might just put that somewhere else. But, um, maybe some of this. It's going to go into my rollover account. And then, yeah, at the end, when I... Add up all of my sinky funds for the month. Actually, I want to put this back up there. When I do my sinking funds for the month, I will distribute that and decide where it's going to go. Right now, my main goal is my emergency fund. All right, so allowance is not getting anything. School activities is going to be getting $5. Um, I just found out that driver's ed is $120. Plus, you have to buy a $25 book, and then you have to, um, well, you don't have to take classes, but if you take classes, they're like 500 bucks for three two-hour lessons. And I'm like, oh my god, it's so much. And I don't trust people with three two-hour lessons. <laughs> like, I don't think six hours is going to teach you how to drive in, in the streets of, like, a huge city like this one. Like, today, I actually seen someone driving the wrong way, and thank God a cop was there, um, and pulled them over, like, ASAP, but driving down a one-way street the wrong way. Yeah. I bet you they took that three-hour or two-hour class. All right, so for school activities, it's five, six, seven, eight. And nine dollars right now. Um, she has her own sinking funds that she's putting money toward. She doesn't know about this one. So, um, let's see. Avery's clothes is gonna get five dollars, and and this is basically for um spring clothes, stuff like that. She also has a sinking fund, but I mean, even though my kids don't really go anywhere, she only gets at the most five dollars a week you know <laughs> so it's twenty dollars a month that's not enough to buy a wardrobe so i have five ten eleven and twelve all right family family is going to be getting five dollars and i have like some gift cards in there as well so I have, let me see I'm actually going to take this out and change it. I have 10, 20, and 25 in family. I did that because I don't think I have enough fives. Kitties is going to be getting $5. This is for extra litter boxes and stuff like that. So I have 10, 15, and 20. Um, let's see. Back to school is not getting anything. Neither are those. All right. My last two are going to be... I have this one. So, let's see. College. Which nursing school is expensive, guys. Five dollars. 
or $10. I'm going to put it in there so I have 10, 20, 25, 26, and 27. And then what else do I need? I wanted to do a oh, self love. This is just in case I need something, which I don't know what I would need. I was thinking about buying nail polish, and then I was in there looking at nail polish, and it was $8 for the cheapest nail polish in Walmart. And I put that back and walked out. Because <laughs> that's insane. So here is $5 in there. I love these little stickers, though. Like, Tim Burton's my favorite. Alright, and now I have some money for my challenges. Again, try to do this, like, really quick. Alright. What I need to do is choose another color. Because I feel like everything is blue, but it's literally the one that's near me. Oh, I'm going to do a debt video soon. Tell you where I'm at. Did I put this back? I did. Alright. So, I have my Dutch, or sorry, my challenge binder, I should say. Laptop is going to be getting $10. I'm actually not even going to count this. I'm just going to put it in there. So, $10 for my laptop. We're going to put this in there. So what are you guys saving for? Do you have any saving challenges? I see a lot of people. Um, One YouTuber who I was watching. I can't remember which one it is. I think it's Taylor Budget. Is saving for a Gucci belt. I think it's her. And I was like, damn, that was expensive. But you know what? You save it, you earn it. You will get that. Let's see. But I was like, wow, I could do that? <laughs> I need to start doing that. There's so much that I want. I'm like, I want a lounge fly bag. But I'm like, there's so many that I see that I want that I'm like, mm, yeah. So I have $20. Then I'm going to put in my emergency fund. Oh, not counting it. Sorry, guys. I keep forgetting that I'm doing that. But yeah, I I want a lounge fly bag. My bestie is like, she wants them too. And she's starting to collect them. And I'm like, oh my god. I'm going to go pay her a visit and steal some from her. <laughs> I love you, Jen. I'm going to steal it. Alright, we got $20. I'm just going to fill in the one down here. But yeah, I seen one. And I tried to actually buy it for myself for um for Christmas. It was a... Edward Scissorhands lounge fly bag and um I had it in my car I purchased it everything and the next thing I know is that um Hot Topic actually they um they got rid of of the bag like they they just didn't have it anymore and I wanted to cry all right so I have ten dollars left and I am going to be putting that into my debt binder so just throw that in there I want to do the snowball, the snowball, um, like, I guess, payoff with the baby steps where, where you get rid of your debt, um, by paying off, like, the smallest one, but I have to figure all of that out first and then see how much I could start throwing toward that, but this one right here, if I don't pay stuff off, I don't have anything that equals $750, but, um... I, I don't know. I might put this toward my student loans because I owe 17 grand in student loans already. I switched majors because I didn't know what I wanted to do. I never finished the first one. It's just, it's a mess. So, <laughs> yeah. All right. But at least I'm paying some of it off, right? All right, guys. So, actually, look at that was five. I need to fill in another one. Because I talk too much. Alright. 
All right, so I got that in there. Oh my gosh, my friend just texted me. See, she knew that I was talking about her lunch wise. All right, guys, so I am all done with this cash stuffing. I tried to go through it as quick as possible, so it is 25 minutes in. I'm sorry. I hope that you guys stayed to the end. Um, I'm going to be going over my debt soon. I'm going to be going over, um, like, ways that I'm hopefully going to tackle 2023. I know that it is now February, but I've been thinking a lot about it, and I feel like maybe on the 1st of January, you shouldn't just throw random stuff at the wall and hope that it sticks like maybe you should think about it process it what's going to change what needs to change what can happen so i'm going to go be going over that um with you guys as well but in the meantime i hope that you guys have a really great day and thanks for hanging out with me all right guys bye oh and don't forget to subscribe and like this video all right bye guys